So this is my main top bar hive. Uh, I just thought I'd show you how the bees are flying. They seem to be doing quite strong. Plenty of pollen going in. You can see it's got a periscope entrance there. It enters on the inside of the hive. And that at the bottom there is an eco floor. So that's full of uh, wood chips, um, well seasoned wood chips. Uh, I'm not going to be opening this hive today because I'm doing a training session with someone tomorrow, but um, I'll include an update uh, in the blog entry so people know how it's getting on after I've done it. So I won't be videoing it tomorrow because I want to concentrate on the person that I'm helping train. So it's getting quite congested there. Now I do have side entrances on each side so I can open them up um, if I find it's getting too congested to help them um, fill up the honeycomb because obviously the brood nest is this end and it goes along the honeycomb. They are currently built out to how many bars? Um, let's see here. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 bars. Um, I'm using the pin system to, to tell me what's on the bar, which uh, I got from Julie at Happy Hour at the Top Bar Hive. So green, the last time I inspected it, tells me there's uh, yellow pins of honey, blue is some drone brood, green is brood, white was a new bar that I inserted, uh, red is normally queen cells, but if I put them this, this end, then it means they've got queen cups. If I put them there, then, then, then they've got um, food in. Uh, if I put them there, then they're full queen cells. So I've changed the coding slightly, and then these are the follower boards at the moment here. I've got someone laying on my arm. Um, so these went in nearly two weeks ago. You can see I, I, I gapped the brood nest, so there's three frame, uh, bars of brood, one empty, two bars of brood, one empty, nearly three bars of brood. Uh, so hopefully that'll help prevent them swarming. If they swarm, so be it. I've got bait hives out and I live in the middle of the countryside, you can see. Although there's cars going past. There ain't a lot of people, I'm on the ed edge of a village. So, um, I'll give you an update in the blog.